Fredericks, Ace of Vegas here. Hope you're doing well. And today, I think it's time for a little poolside brunch. It's the Ace of Vegas, the Ace of Vegas. Wow. I sure do make it pretty easy to get into the pools over here. Just straight down the stairs, and if you want back out, you can take the escalator out. So we're gonna go ahead and see if we can hit the Cabana Grill at the MGM Grand Pool Complex. Can I see the sign up there? All right. So there's one that's an entrance and one that's an exit only. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get a room key and we're gonna get started. I'm not quite pool dressed yet. But it's cool. Also, let me get my uh, card out. And yeah, I guess uh, we're trying to socially distance. Look at that. Very nice. How's it going, bud? Perfect. Alright, you're off there. Thanks. Alright, I love this. Okay. And this is what the pool area is looking like right now. It's actually not too bad. The pool is very, very... It's actually kind of loaded right now. A lot of kids out, I noticed. That's interesting. is back to being open. Of course, you got the old MGM brand logo over here too. Very nice. Looks like the Lucky Bar is back to being open. And they're supposed to be reopening What Republic today, so I might go check that out tomorrow. All right, but yeah, let's go ahead and take a nice stroll through the pool area, and we're gonna check out the cabana bar. So the main pool and spa is right here. Yeah, definitely a good time, but I am starving. So yeah, let's go ahead and figure out this whole food thing. Okay, we followed the signs, and here it is. The Cabana Grill, hard left over here towards the Lazy River. Now the Lazy River actually isn't open right now. If you guys wanna see, that is not open as we speak. But, the Cabana Grill is. So let's go to the Cabana Grill instead. So I'm hungry and there are lots of lovely places to come outside and eat here. So that's nice. Shame about the Lazy River though. You guys can see it's pristine right now, beautiful. It's just closed. Which makes sense because it's kind of a hot spot for people. So I understand why they close it.
All right. And now here we are on the MGM Grand Cabana Grill. So yeah, let's go ahead and see if they have anything good for us here. Oh, thank God they have the misters over here too to help you keep cool. So plenty of water out here still in Vegas. All right. And here we go. That is the Cabana Grill walk up. So we can check out the menu up there and see what we need. Okay guys, I am starving. So we decided to go ahead and get the airplane apparently. Hang on just a second. Okay guys, so we decided to go ahead and get the uh, fresh mozzarella and turkey sandwich over here. And then we also got some, uh, some salt and pepper crisps. As our friends say back in uh, back in England, crisps instead of chips. Same thing really, but you know. Let's try the turkey and mozzarella sandwich over here today. All right guys, uh, the rest of the pool is looking pretty calm right now. I'm sitting under a mister, so if there's a hissing sound, that's what that is. That is the mister doing its work. There it is, right there. Um, but yeah, the whole rest of the place is pretty chill. It's still kind of early. It's only about noon. Um, most people were definitely out late partying last night. It hasn't gotten crazy busy yet. Alright, let's go ahead and have a bite of this. Looks like it's got some cranberry in here too. So it's like uh, how you make yourself a sandwich after uh, after Thanksgiving if you uh, if you partake in Thanksgiving, of course. Mm. So it's not too bad actually. I'm enjoying the mozzarella. I'm glad that they use spinach instead of uh, lettuce, too. So that's good. I don't like lettuce. Just not a big lettuce sort of guy. I think it's kind of a garbage vegetable. And of course, tomato, too. I really, I was really kind of hoping it was going to be hot. Didn't expect it to be cold there. Uh, I probably did say so on the menu, so if I have a problem, hey, that's my fault, honestly. Mm. This guy's kind of a... Yeah, kind of a nice little Dijon mustardy sort of sauce there. It's kind of creamy, though. Yeah, it's a pretty solid sandwich. Definitely would be better if it was hot, but yeah, I'll still give it a 4 out of 5. Not too bad. And I do enjoy these. Uh, I know that these uh, salt and pepper kettle chips are great, too. Um, we have those back home, obviously. So that's not a big deal. But I thoroughly enjoy that. So that's good stuff. All right, it's finished the shark, so that was a pretty good lunch, I gotta admit. Um, was really actually kind of surprised this heating was pretty uh, pretty well done. I wish there was a little more kind of care put into where everybody ended up getting placed, not like it was super busy or anything like that. We were allowed to pick our own seats and people were being smart about it, so it was no big deal. But just kind of a couple little notes there. But that's all I got on the uh, Cabana Grill. Viva, 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 Viva,